There it is, I'm feeling that! We're back in. We are back in. And once we open that handle, bad things happen. But we Um, we've made it! Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! Who the heck is that? Okay, come on, come on. Okay, I must make this quick. I'll give you this advice only once because I don't got time to give it you again, okay? Do not stare at the TV. The TV's always wanting you to stare. But the message it gives you, it ain't what you think. Crap, he's coming. Guys, heed my advice. Never stare at the TV. If you see it, look the other way. Find a way to break it as quick as you can. I gotta get out of here real quick, okay? have anything to do with this? What kind of prank is this? I mean, as a matter of fact, I don't ever remember there being a hole in that corner down there. Now, I'm gonna have to watch that carefully. So, what is going on, guys? This is Ryan here, and welcome back to another episode of Little Nightmares 2. This is gonna be part four in the adventure, and just when you think things can't get much worse, they go ahead and prove you wrong at time and time again, okay? And I ain't hyped to see what happens here. Before we get much further into this video, guys, I just wanna go ahead and give a massive shout out to Herman Miller for providing me with a brand new chair that my butt cheeks are right now sitting on. I wanna explain a little bit about this chair, guys, because it's kind of crazy how something as small as a chair can make such a big difference to how you feel every day. I think office workers and people like myself who spend eight to ten hours every single day at our computer doing some kind of work forget how important it is not just to be able to sit down, but to have something as well that supports you that entire way because your back gets cracked up when you sit on a bad chair, guys. And I'm just saying this, this chair does a lot of really cool stuff and I gotta talk about this. All right, I'm still doing a really bad job of showing the chair. Look, guys, here it is, it's sick, look at that. The way that this chair is designed to actually fit with the posture and the way your spinal curve actually goes. It's honestly helped my back pains quite a lot, guys, okay? The chair also has a really interesting cooling foam technology within, which, first of all, I don't know how it works. You know when you have those long gaming periods where you just sat down and then when you stand up and it literally sounds like you got Valco under your legs? Yeah, I don't have that happen no more. It has even pressure distribution, so like when you're sitting down, no matter how you are, you always feel comfortable. It's kind of crazy how much technology and thought has been put into a chair. Now, you know most products that you buy also, you go ahead and get 12 months free warranty which, you know, that's kind of cool. This chair gives you 12-year warranty. If you guys want to see more information about this chair, you can check the link in the description down below. This is honestly a chair which has helped me out. And I know if other people are suffering with back problems and things like that, it will help you out too. Chairs are seriously worth the investment, guys, considering how long you actually spend in them. All right, now let's get to the video. As I'm sure you guys can already hear, there is some strange things happening. Like, don't you dare fizzle out on me. Yeah, man, this place is not good, though. I don't know where we've ended up. It seems to be some kind of apartment complex and... And it seems like the residents for this one, they didn't get chance to leave, perhaps. Like, I'm starting to think maybe everyone wanted to leave in a hurry for good reason. Now, if you have missed the previous episodes, I will be linking the playlist down below. And if I forget, which most likely I'm going to go ahead and do, you can find it on the channel, guys. But I want to get going with this thing. But wait, hold up. Six got something to say? Wait, you want to get 30k likes in this video? What the, is she crazy? We can't do that, can we? All right, let's go anyway. That sounds like a cartoon of some kind. All right, let me turn the light off a second. Look at the light beaming through that door. Like, it leaves so many questions immediately as to what's happened to the residents. We've got our man here. He doesn't respond to the flashlight being shone on him. He clearly knows we're here, but he doesn't care that much whatsoever. It's hard to tell as well if he's cowering from the TV or if the door is, in fact, blocking him from watching it. I don't know, guys. But how about we leave him for now, okay? Let's uh, take a look on the couch. Things dusty and crusty and pretty much other than the smell of butt crack, this thing has nothing more for us. Now, hold on. I am kind of curious what happens if we approach him because what I'm hoping we can do at some point is maybe try and, like, spook one of these people. I know it's not the nicest thing to do, guys, but it might trigger a chain reaction and that's what I'm kind of thinking is what we might want to do here. Is there any obstacles? I mean, like, we've got some things down here. Oh, we can't pick them up. Also, hey, lady. Yeah, we met you last time, didn't didn't we? Yeah, we did. Now, I can't find anything specific to actually throw at them, so I think... Okay, the TV's back on. They really want to see what's on, huh? I'm gonna walk nice and close. Now, he's probably gonna get angry, guys, but I just want to see if they're all the same way. If I go ahead and grab this dude's leg, let me see what happens. Uh, oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Like... What is going on? Slenderman grew a head of hair. Yeah, man, the residents in this place, I think they didn't get a chance to escape. I'm starting to believe that's uh, the main issue here. Uh, okay, we checked the couch. I just want to see again if there's anything more. It really don't look like it, guys, and we can't pull it. Let's get moving through this, huh? We've got this lady fixated on just TV fuzz down here. I don't really know if the noise is coming from it. Oh, whoa, 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 hold up. So what about if I take this back and throw it at the dude? I just want to see, man. Hey, buddy, here's a can of beans for your troubles. Okay, we missed him. He didn't even respond. We get a temp to. Don't mind me. Let me just take my can of beans back. So throw it like that. 
It seems to miss him. Is that me just being a bad shot? He's unresponsive to it. When you try and throw it at him, Dang, I was wondering if there was maybe a way we could try and open the door, but it does not look like it, guys. We've got a doorway here. Yeah, that thing's sealed tight. We ain't gonna get through there. Let's go on through, then. We've got light in here. Ooh. Yeah, this place was left to ruins. We can see the floor completely caved through. It makes you think, like, what happened, though? That would have taken a lot of force to cave on through. And, of course, it went ahead and did it fairly successfully. Can I climb the bookcase here? Nah, just a simple pull-up. All right, let's take a look at the paintings on the wall. Looking like, uh, we got someone's lower half and maybe a hotel lobby or something like that. Got to plug in the wall over there. But, uh, yeah, we probably want to reach this door handle. So, Six, I'm going to need your assistance, all right? That's it. You post up. Let's go. Oh, sorry for the light. <laughs> Keeping it on in her face, though. Here we go. Um, you're taking a bath with your TV, fella? I think you might want to put a stop to that. I'm just saying, if that falls in, you might be in trouble. Let me just give him a helping hand. Let me see if we can pull the plug. It feels like, can we not pull the plug, though? We can. Hey, Six, help me out. Help me out. Come on. I can't get it. Oh, that's an optional secret, though. Six, come on. Please help me. Come on, look. We can grab onto it. There's a reason why, man. Hmm. Let me look in this room. Yeah, he's watching that TV. He's fixed on it. We'll probably grab onto the edge of the bath. Now, look. We can't even do that. Let me push the door shut. Maybe there's something, like, behind here we can see. The show was that important, though, huh? You just couldn't miss it. Yeah, it goes all the way back. Hold up. Let me just take a peek through here. I'm wondering if there's an item we can take back on ourselves. Okay, it's a one way. Six, don't do it. Open this up for me. Let's go. Come on. Okay, let me go on through. Back through, back through. Are you serious? I can't go back? I kind of want to start from checkpoint. Let me go. Guys, I tried everything to try and unplug the TV. It doesn't seem like we could. Or maybe there's an optional item that we needed to get on route. Ah, dang it. It was worth... Ooh. Okay, it was worth a shot. But just... Okay, jumping the gap might be worth a shot. We got an elevator system. All right, now let me just judge the drop, okay, Six? If I go ahead and throw this, this my ankles? Huh. Because that don't bode well. Hold up, hold up. Oh, okay, we made it, we made it. Oh, we're going all the way down. Okay, Six, I see that. So this must have been like another staircase, uh, another staircase way down. Um, and like another area of the lobby or something like that. I don't know, guys. Is this going to work? We got power. Oh, we got some power reserves. Looking at things. Take a peek up. We're going straight to the top. That has a key on it, though. So, hold up. Let me just drag that back down. If there's a key on that, we need to find an item. And it looks like it's right there. That's a way we can definitely climb up. So, do we time the jump? Let me try this, guys. Prep, prep, prep. Six, be ready. Let's follow. Here we go. And we're timing the jump. And let's go. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Six days in the- You shouldn't even come with me, though! Alright, we'll take C to this one, okay? We can get this. Six, hold tight in the elevator and pull that lever once it comes back down, alright? Gotta do this for us. Let me just check up there. Wonder, can we jump across here? We can grab on. Let me explore a little bit higher, guys. I'm wondering if they hide a secret up here. So we can climb a decent way. Let me see. Here we go on top. We can perch, but... What do we see, though? I can't... Wait. It's the way we get up. Now, before we do that... I can't go back. Are you kidding me? We will go the additional optional way, okay, guys? We will. So, we need to try and get that lever right there. It will open the door. But we probably still need to uh, focus on getting the key, which is right there. As simple as just opening a drawer. Open that a bit more. That one's jammed up, dude. Now, before we leave, let me just take a look at the pictures on the wall over here. I'm always liking to do this. Uh, we'll get some light. Um... There's a gnome right there again. You know, I still haven't seen a gnome in this game. I've been looking everywhere. I wonder where they're hiding out. They gotta be close by. They have to be. Right, well, let's take the key anyway. That goes in the back pocket, and we don't want to take anything more. Uh, no, me in the cup. Let's see. Uh, yeah, I don't think so. If he was, he was probably dead by now. <laughs> Not the best way to look at things, but you know. All right, let's uh put the key in the lock anyway. Open that up. A6, welcome to the floor. All right, I don't think there's much more there. So before we even go and get the elevator lift thing, I think I'm going to drag this back down. Six, hold up. I've got a plan. But let me see. Go along, dude. Woo! I knocked my man unconscious. Okay, let's go. Let's go. All right, I wonder if you could pull the elevator before Six even gets a chance to get <laughs> Honestly, only I'm thinking something like that, right, though? Ah, uh, make the jump now. So we're investigating what the freak was this way. Oh, the grab mid-fall. I'm liking that, man. I'm liking that. All right, let's go. Let's go. There's got to be something more. Maybe another one of those static things? Nope. There's nothing else there, so coming back here was literally pointless. Yeah, this floor seems kind of quiet, though. Uh, like, all we can really do is free Six. Okay, yeah, you come around this way a bit more. Let me see what's down the end, if anything. It doesn't look like much, guys. We've got a door. Six don't want to boost us up, even though I definitely want to explore every single room we can. And yeah, we'll get the light off. I see you holding your eyes. So, you better give me a leg up, Six. Let's do this. 
This is probably the switch to make us go a bit higher. Though, let's see. Hold up. I've pulled the lever. Ah, maybe it then makes the elevator be like, this is the ground floor, and then we go one up. All right, six, you gotta step inside. You don't wanna come up a floor? All right, well, see yourself, I'll go without you. Let's- Oh, for God's sake. Ah, so it doesn't work the way intended, I see. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on, I'm a bit lower than last time though, right? Um, let me go up a bit. Oh no, maybe that was the right height. Um, who knows? Okay, well, we've learned our lesson there. What did pulling the lever do? Let's explore the room to our left-hand side, the office space here. Did anything else as a result? Go ahead and move. Certainly don't look like it. There's a leak up top. Um, do we want to maybe like climb up top here? I don't know. How about we try and like hop, hop on top here? Can we pull ourselves up? Hey, let's go. So we hop on the window ledge here. Uh, I ain't seen any reason behind why we'd want to do this. There's got to be something more here, right? Let me try and hop on here. Do we walk along maybe? Uh, I really don't see anything here. Can I jump up? I just bumped my head on the top. So we're looking for maybe a crack or something. There was a reason we had to get six through here. She wants us to... Hold up, did we not do it since we died? Um, pull that again? I don't understand. So I did it, but nothing's really changing as a result. That's the... Yeah, nothing's really immediately changing at least. Six is just weighing here. Does she want me to do something? I'm so confused. Yeah, I really don't know what I'm doing right now, guys. This... This seems like the button doesn't do anything. Let me pull this down again. Um, I don't know. Are we supposed to do this? We hop off this real quick. So if that goes down, do we grab the wire? Like, do we climb up to the top? Because we know that there's a, an area above. Um, I don't know. Oh, Six knows what to do. Okay. Oh, right, right, right. Wait for it to come back. Oh, Six, stop pushing me. Stop pushing me. Now we hop on like now, I guess? Yeah, 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 yeah. Aha. Oh, look at that. A huge crank at the top pulling this guy up. Ooh, I see that. And there's- Hello? Oh, there is something back there. Six, you want to do a bit of optional exploring maybe? Look at this small little crawl space right here though. Let's see. You hear the ambience coming in straight away too? Oh, it's a flashback. So, we've got multiple rope nooses and they've- What the- Why is the crow in the jar like that? Um, I don't know. Let's get that flashback. Ah, uh, that kind of hurt. You can see though, there's pictures all around. Someone was staying here. There's like a boy and a girl down there. There's notes. Wow. Well, that room kind of sucks. Also, we got TP over there with no toilet. So I think you know the end result. Room probably smells worse than my back meat after all the running. Probably all we needed to see there. So yeah, that's uh, pretty much what brought us up. We just got to keep crawling on through. Someone else maybe broke through. Oh, we're back out. Wow, that feels awesome. Look at the view. Dang. Before we go further, let me see. Can I climb up here? You hear that music kicking? That's epic. Let me try and walk around the edge. I don't know if we can do anything here, guys. I'm trying everything I, I can think of. Climb the drain pipe. Nah, man. There's nothing. Let's go. All right. Wait, what? It oh, is that the broadcast tower? Is that what's... Because you can see that's got power here. Woo! Go for the jump. Oh, yes. Six, you got it. We know you do. Yeah, I think that's the broadcast tower in the distance right there, guys. What's it submitting as the message, huh? It's telling something right now. Can we open this door maybe? Let me see. Try and push it. Six doesn't even help. She knows that thing's wild and shut. We get it. There's no point investigating. Let's climb though. Do we keep scaling up this thing or are we trying to like get around these buildings? Because like, that door's been barricaded up. Whatever went down in there, they didn't want it happening anymore. So I see this. Yeah, we, we need a crank. We'll turn that off. I'm just blinding six this whole playthrough, honestly. Can she even see what we're doing now? Oh, yeah, this was made by our people. Definitely. So we draw that. Aha. And then we let six get across. Uh, you better go ahead and, you know, push the right back once you're done. There you go. That will do nicely. So now, how do I get across? She's waiting. You want me to make the jump, so I'm the one doing the risky moves. All right, let's go. Let's go. You can do this, Mono. You can do this on the edge. Woo, let's go. Perfect. Oh, yeah. You see, it's literally get some mid-air. We had that magician action right there. Nice. All right. Let's go. Let's keep going up. We need to find another opening, maybe in a building. Something like that. And I wouldn't be at all surprised, guys, if in the next, like, couple of minutes once we get inside, we are going to experience maybe a third time what the TV's doing. And there's got to be a reason why we're being so obsessed with it. And Six is very resilient and always fighting against whatever the broadcast is trying to emit inside of our brains. I mean, not just our brains though, but like 
every single person by the looks of it. Like, everyone gets affected by this thing very, very badly, and it's not good. They don't even have faces. It's like no identity. They're just living for whatever's on the TV. Is it the visuals? Is it simply the sound? If they're not even looking at what they're, you know, experiencing on the TV, that's not obviously a factor whatsoever. Right, this door has been pushed shut by the dirt and debris collecting. It's a broken TV, and there's a large gaping hole in the roof. That thing is fit to fall. I don't trust that. Let's move, let's move. Uh, let me go behind this thing. Try and see if there's anything I can grab holding that button. There was nothing. Still no optional hats. I'm looking though, I'm looking. I really do think even if I found those optional hats though, I wouldn't change out of the paper bag. It's my identity. Oh. Ooh. Hold back, hold back, six. That TV is gonna fall. Whoa, in the back. Oh, that's gonna go. Is he gonna go? Hold on, move, move, move. Woo! Oh, we gotta go! Come on, Six, we gotta move! There's no door handle! Ah, uh, ah, uh, do we push? Push! Ah! Uh, there's a problem. Six, listen, I've known you too long! I didn't even get to finish my sentence. Can I push it though? I don't know! Oh, we're trying it! Oh, come on! Yes! Oh, yes, look above, look above. Yeah, this place is fit to collapse on our head, Six! Run! That's it. You get the head start. Don't wait for me. I was joking. Help me. I'm slower than you. Oh, God. Sorry, that's fine. Why did Six just stop? All right, go for the jump. Just do it, man. Just do it. Just go for the jump. Are we good? I am so confused. Why does Six keep collapsing at that point? Wait. This was meant to happen. No, 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 Move. Flashlight's broken. I don't care. Come on. Get her out. Get her out. Get her out. Grab her. Grab her. That's it. That's it. Come on. You're only stuck temporarily. She's good. She's good. Okay. Mono, move. Mono, please. You gotta get up, buddy. It's weak behind. Get out of danger's way. Move. Come on. Oh, thank goodness. That cutscene concerned me. You okay, Six? Gonna hold hands? Come on. Let's walk together. Let's walk together through this one. This place is complete ruins. All right, got to give me a leg up here. I know you're probably completely debilitated of your strength, but if we don't muster on, this place will take us both down when it collapses. Got to be one step ahead of the building, because if we're not, it's going to remind us pronto. Oh, hold up. This room feels significant. Look at what we've got. Let's get the light. I'm pressing the light button, dude. We don't even have a light anymore. Okay, we've got the dude on the wall over there. It's the same drawing. Who is this man? There's multiple of him. We've got like the spiral thing. We've got the clothing that's just been left and the eye. And on the TV over there, it says, there's some text on that. I can't make it out though. Let me just take a look under the bed. Is there anything more? It certainly doesn't look like it. Uh, it was worth investigating, but no, there's nothing. And I can hear a TV in the distance. Someone's watching their favorite program. As much as I don't want to watch it, I'm always watching it, guys. It's always the reoccurring thing. And I'm taking this block with me. This block's mine. Actually, you know what? Maybe I should leave it for safekeeping. So there you go. I'm sure the kid can find that. Look at this mail. All just coming through the door. Oh, I was hoping we could pull that and maybe take a look, but nah. So he's had posts coming through. I caught it with the TV flashback. Come on, right, guys? Here we go. Let's just get it done with. It's going to get to us. So move towards it. Instead of fighting it, go towards it. Let's get this ordeal over with as soon as we can. Six will pull us out. We still don't know what's at the door at the end. Right? Okay, there it goes, there it goes. Six is holding back. She's holding strong against all of whatever this thing's trying to do. Right, that's it, that's it. Right there, right there, right there. I'm seeing it, I'm seeing it. Is that good? It's stabilizing. Come on, there it is, there it is, there it is, there it is, there it is. Nah, that fight's back. Here we go, here we go. Right there, right there. Ooh, third time's a charm, though. Third time's a charm. Pull it, pull it, pull it. I'm seeing it, I'm seeing it. It's there, it's very close. There it is, I'm feeling that. We're back in. We are back in. What's behind the door? Why? We try and get there. It almost concerns me like, does running to the door? Does that represent us losing our mind towards it? Like, here we go. In this moment, guys, we are losing our mind. We're becoming brainwashed by the TV running to the door to open it. And once we open that handle, bad things happen. But we um, hang on. We've made it. Oh no, Six, pull us out. Six, you gotta pull us out. Um, all we do is... Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! Who the heck is that? Um, fire! Fire! Come on! He stands up! You hearing this? Look at her, she's cowering in a 
away. She don't like. He's in the TV. Dude, she's ushering us away. Go, 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 go. Yeah, we gotta get away. Oh my God, dude, it's the Grudge. Stop the Grudge, the ring. What am I talking about? Oh, bro, fight it, fight it. He's coming. Oh, that's terrifying. Run. Run, 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 run. Don't let him get to you. Don't let him get to you. I want to see him though. Let me see him. Oh my god. Who is he? 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 Hide. Hide. She hides there. She hides there. I'm going under here. Let's go. No, I can't. Okay, I'm in. I'm in. Look at him standing there. Six, come on. Come to me. Come to me. Come to me. How could. What the freak? No, 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 no. No, six. So that's what those glitches are. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This can't be happening. This can't be happening. So the glitchiness that we see. Look at the TV first. Look, can we go back in that? It's just us. We're all alone. Let me try. Let me try. What's happening? What's happening? Is it worth it? I don't know, guys. It's one more. Why are you sitting on a couch so high up? I can't reach it. My legs hurt. You know what? Leg pains can wait. We'll recover from that. We'll recover from that. Oh my goodness. I'm in a state of shock right now. Like, what? we need to do something. We have to do something here. There has to be some way we can change the events. Okay, think. There's something in this room that we need. There is something in this room that we need. Some way to interact, to maybe move an object. The only thing I can pretty much climb on is this chair here, guys. But that... Oh, 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 oh. I take that back. Okay, long jump, long jump. Mm-hmm. Look at this. Game plan. Game plan. Can we make the jump? Come on, dude. You can't reach from there? We need to find a way up a little bit higher. That ain't high enough. Can we try and make the jump? It leads us up here. Oh, wait. No, no. Silly me. We can just climb that. All right, we got to get back up. Let's figure out where we landed and how we can get back to wherever we got to be. Okay, that's not how we do it, though. There you go. That's how we do it. That is exactly how we do it. Okay, I am trying to make sense of this world that we're in. Or something more, but there's not much. So we came through that TV in the center and fell. We gotta take another loop through. We're finally giving in. Will this pay off? Paul, oh, eat your heart. Let's do this right now, okay? Okay, we gotta think differently for these puzzles then, guys. So, wait, how do we go ahead and get this to move? Because we need to get over there. But if it's just us... I got a bad feeling about this long term. How are we about to get this? Okay, so if we know this TV is a pole, we have to think on our feet. If we place the TV there, hopefully... Oh, yeah, we can reach this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And we gotta go for it. Let's... Okay, we didn't even need to play that rescue, but we still did. So this TV leads to the next TV. X and Y, okay? If we go through X, we come out at Y. Slipping down the grates a small amount, but not enough to take us off our path. Let's do this. Let's do this. I'll climb inside. Look at all the, like, clothing just draped out, though. It gives you an idea of the urgency that went down and how fast things really descended within this place. People didn't really have any time to react whatsoever to the tragedies that were occurring. They just had to move with the motions and accept it. Try their best to escape, and apparently going naked was the way forward. That's why we find all the clothes, right? I ain't gonna be seen wearing rags anymore, dude. I'll just be in my skin. What? I don't know. I, I think that's a bad theory, guys. Don't believe that one. So anyway, let's proceed on. Look at that. Wood laid around the side, fit to fall, but who placed it, huh? I'm always asking that question. Someone placed that there for us to go ahead and get across. And I thank you for your time and your effort in doing so. Probably very dangerous before that. Okay, another TV there. Well, that's blaring them tunes. Okay, okay, I see that. Now, let's hop on down here. Maybe we gotta... Hold up. Look, this dude, it's the clothes again. Something, like, sucks them out. Maybe they, like, touch the TV and that's it? I don't know. Let me see, does the TV work still? Oh, here we go, here we go! Press the button, let's go. Is it working? Like, press the button, maybe? That's it, that's it, we created a portal. Let's, uh, put the controller down for now, maybe? 
want to hold on to that. Nothing really much more down here. Well, let's get brought up through. TV remote, I hope you come with. We're going to be eating you a lot. And I mean a lot. There's another... Oh, we didn't get the remote. Okay, we're a problem. So, TV number two is right there. Before we go and jump through. Hey, let's go. I hear the metal. Okay, okay. Bit of a contrast, but I'll see what you're doing here. Look at all these parcels. This is what this room is. It's like a storage zone. Uh, I wonder. Are we in some kind of like mailing center or something like that? We could be. Okay, let's try and swing across before we even touch that TV. We don't know where that thing will warp us to. Hmm. Starting to feel like we should do that first now. So let's go on our gut on this one, okay? Let's go ahead and see where this TV takes us. It might not be good, but generally we're used to that now, guys, right? Oh, wait, can we reach that? I don't think we can reach that. Look. Also, why does this music feel so happy all of a sudden? I'm a little bit confused. There's like a, a charmingness to the, the songs that we're hearing or something like that. Yes! Oh, hey! We got that optional hat. Give me that good stuff. Please, officer. Yeah, call me Detective Mono at your service. I gotta try the hat on. Hey, look at that. Okay, okay. I see that, I see that. Still liking the paper bag more. It's, it's honestly, it's his trademark right now, guys. He can rock the other hats, but it's gotta go back, Mono. I'm so sorry. Okay, let's see what's through this way here. Is it uh, just an optional path? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I've only just realized we can press the TV remote. Okay, we'll try that with the TV then. I wasn't sure we had it on us still. Let's move on through, let's see. Okay, we're on the other side of the mailing room. Large gap there, aha. So if we fall, we're probably going to use this as a shortcut. This should bring us out, I think, to where we're back on ourselves. It gives us a temper for two of this. So it was on the right path before. That's it. And drop down. Ooh, yes. Ooh, yes. I wonder how this game will work when it comes to speedruns and stuff, man. Because you already know people are going to be planning their ways to beat this game as quick as possible. And I'm kind of hyped to see it. Oh, wait. Now that is the issue, isn't it? Because how the heck do we get across now? What the freak? Why is that wiggling like that? Um, excuse me, Wooden Plank, are you hinting towards that being the success? Let me press a button. Why didn't you work? Can I, like, jump across here? I couldn't even grab the handle, so let's uh, try and think now. What do we need to... Is it this here? Maybe we drag this as a midway point? Oh, yeah, I saw that twitch. I see that. Mail service coming through. Delivery spot? Apparently right here. I don't care about the destination that was once held. That's the new destination. Deal with it. And this is why we use that destination. Jump one successful and jump number two. Just grab on the side. That's it. Why is that piece of wood wiggling like that? Made of jelly? A fake piece of wood? Almost believing so. <laughs> okay, let's go. Look at this though, man. Stacks of mail. You don't know what's in these. Might have been an invitation to a very nice place. You know, maybe a spot on the moor. But they didn't get to get to it. Oh! Uh... I should have let go like five seconds ago, shouldn't I? You know, before I came through. Talking of uh, letting go, we can explore. Oh, I hear someone there. Ooh, look at this room here. You see, it pays to look back. Oh, it does. So what do we see in here? Let's go on. Let's see, it's a flashback. We... Whoa, it's the... It's the geisha? Hang on, what does the newspaper say? We see the eye on that thing. Um, this is a real throwback. Whoa, that's awesome. Now, if we take this, do we smash it? Let me see. Unladylike. Yeah, I get the achievement there. I know, I know. How about... Oh, can we climb these? Oh, man. That was cool as a flashback, though. Sick. The geisha lady, though, she was very well off. Very fortunate, it seemed. Well, until, of course, Six turned up. That makes me question, like... I don't, I don't know. Did she live there? Was she looked up to by these people? Maybe there was a way out, and they took it. Oh, hold up. Can we press the channel? Let me try this. Hold up. Oh, I want to turn the TV up. Hey, lady. Just uh, changing the channel. Ah! Shut up, my God! You like the TV channel, huh? Was she like a cleaner or something? We can see she's got like the sanitation gloves and the uh, the apron on. Okay, TV goes off. Skip that. Ah, <laughs> prank. Just get pranked. Dude, get pranked. Get pranked. Ah! But it was just a prank, bro. Why do you always... Why do you play so seriously? Do we need the TV? Turn she knows exactly what we are the moment we turn the TV off. Do we want to touch that TV at any point? Um, let me join you, lady. Let me try and grab this thing. Wait, touch the TV! Let she doesn't even let us! Huh, I wonder if there's a reason why we can lure her away. Either way, she's completely brainwashed by whatever's going on in there. Uh, can we actually hop up here? Yes, we can, very simply. I probably want to move across a bit, but yeah, we got no problems hopping up and out. Do we want to lure the lady this way? Um, feels kind of bad if we do, right? Let me just see. We see the balcony. That's our way out. Oh, there's a TV. Turn this thing on. 
Ah, now there's the problem, because we need to use that TV, right, guys? Now, hopefully the window is already wide open. I've got a bad feeling that this thing won't be, though. Let's see. And the window. Wait. Okay, it's got a window pane. Lady, are you a fan of rodeo on daytime TV? Let's find out. Do you get inspired by her? Oh, right, 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 I see. So we get the TV back on. We've got time to touch this thing. Let's go. Take us out, take us out. Photo. Yeah, come on. That's it, that's it. Do you think she's watching the TV outside? How about that? The 3D experience, huh? Bit too realistic. We're a real person merging through TVs. What a crazy situation. So, so bizarre. And all we do is we keep climbing up and out. This part reminds me of like the, it's like the industrial chapter to showcase what goes on in the world past like, you know, uh, I guess industry stuff like hospitals and schools. But now we also got to consider just the citizens because they experience this too. Okay, we got my man over here. He's watching some TV. Now, does the remote go long? Oh, it does. Ooh, this one might be a bit sketchy. So turn that off. Crouch, crouch, crouch. Draw him over. Look at oh! <laughs> All right then, well, let's go. <laughs> oh my god. That made our job so much easier. He's lost. And my game. Pull up, pull up, pull up. Pull up, let's go. Come on. Let's go. A little bit closer than I'd have liked, but okay. Some of these TVs are a one way trip. Like, that one just broke completely. Let's go. Uh, not such a private bathroom, is it? It's not anymore. Yeah, I won't be getting inspired to take a shot. I think I'll go dirty for a while longer. Let's go. This bed ain't gonna hold. Jump on that. Jump across. Okay, prove me wrong. Hey. Let's go down. Let's see in the distance. The shot's coming back, guys. It's drawing back. Look at that in the distance. We see it. Wait, he's standing there watching. There's a guy there. Okay, there's guys there. Oh my goodness. What are you doing? Why are they doing this? It sends shivers down my sp- Whoa! Lil Thorn. Much acting, look, they're just dropping. We can't open that. Oh, man. We can't do anything to prevent this either. There he goes. And the last one here. Are you gonna stick around a bit longer? Or is your mind too far gone? He bows his head. What has this tower done to you people? Look, they're dropping in the back too. What did this do? It completely ate your guys' minds up. Well and truly, and it left no chance of getting back. It removed their faces. Removed their identity. It turned them into a husk that has to obey whatever's going on here. Uh, I mean, there's a cigarette smoking in this room. Now, I don't think that's probably gonna mean anything. I always look too deep into stuff, but... I don't know, man. That means someone clearly knows what they're doing, right? They got some conscious. Got a window open. Let's get the TV on. Come on, remote. There you go. Did we change the channel elsewhere? Let me see. Pull on up, pull on up. All right. I don't know how safe this is. What about if we push the TV down? Maybe we should do this first. All right, let's go. Don't break. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Now I'm seeing the plan. We need that velocity. You know when in, like, portal guys, you jump from a high up, go through, and you get flung across? We've run at this. Run. Let's go. Use that momentum. Mono, why are you standing still? I'm gonna go. I'm throwing something. Space out. That's it, like bad food. That's all it took. I had a door go. That door's been sealed. And there's a crank hidden behind this way. Let's pull it. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, the floor is electrified. Oh. <gasps> Pull it back, pull it back. All right. Now, I think we've got to use this, because the TV's on just outside. Someone wants to come through real soon. How close do we get? Do we pull the planks off? Because we need to move through. Got to remember, guys, six is priority. We're trying to rescue her. Let's go. Pull this, pull this, pull this. Uh, yeah, looking good, looking good. He's going to come on through. He's got the strength. Run, 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 run. Now, hit this, hit this, hit this, hit this. Hit this, come on, let's go, let's go. Pull it, pull it. Whoa. Oh, touching distance. Dang! Let's go. Again, another door sealed up from back here. It seems like now it's maybe just us on the floor. I'm hearing flies coming through here. And you know what fly signifies, guys? Life. Or at least a point of. Oh, so I was nearly right. Now I gotta move this down. Come on, guys. That's it. Yeah! Was this wise? Maybe. Maybe. It's like a trash chute and they kept throwing stuff down there. So, he wait, hold up. What is this on the chair? Dang, that's morbid. We pop the chest open? What's in there? What is that? What is that? There's something of importance, maybe? Look at this. 
Um, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm acting before I even understand. I'll take... No, I don't want the shoe. The shoe can go out there, though. Nice footwear. Let's take the parcel. It gave us this. Why did it give us the parcel more specifically? Are we gonna do the job of the mailman? Let's, uh, put this through. Room service! Okay, we're not doing it. We see the eyeball on that. Like, there's an eye if we turn it this way here. And there's the, the mailbox. Do we throw it through, perhaps? Let me try. Uh, what the heck are we doing? Maybe we gotta drop down with it. Or maybe we place that there. We just need that leg up. Oh, six. If only you were still here to help us. We would have been done with this puzzle long ago. Let this box remind me of you, Six. But I, don't, I don't know if that's gonna make it feel better. It sounds like there's glass in there, though. It's some kind of... I, I think it's broke. <laughs> I've probably, uh, you know, contributed to that breaking a bit more. Let's try this then. So, I can't seem to pull the box here anymore. Wait, I can't hop up on this thing, though? Like, it won't move any closer. How about we try this for a different purpose? Maybe if we pull this all the way back here, uh, we can pull the other lever, which will take us upstairs. Maybe we need to find a way to get that parcel delivered to the resident, or at least ex-resident, because they probably don't exist there anymore. Let's climb on top. First of all, elevator, you can open up. Thank you. Let's get this on. All right, TV is blaring some tunes. Let's try and bring this parcel with us then. So we'll take this. Let's see how far this will take us. Can we not fit through with it? Huh. Okay. Let me just go back upstairs for now. I did see there was... Can we not? There's like dialogue lines. Let's try and go up a floor. Is it up? Okay, there we go. There we go. There's a small opening right there. Not that we'd ever need it. I don't know. It's dragging us up a floor though. Whoa, another floor. Okay. Okay, I'm seeing this. It's really taking us up high. What on earth is this floor? Hey. All right, let's stop focusing on that. Wait, what, what is going on? Can I not move anywhere? Do I get a... What the heck is going on with this, guys? I can't go through the TV and I can't open the grate. Wait. I needed to turn that TV on right there. Can we face the TV? We can. It was really that simple. We gotta get back down. Oh, wait, no. This is the level we're on before. Good stuff. So we can return here. That's good, because I know I wasn't done on this floor yet. Or, wait, maybe I was. Maybe I was already complete here. There's a parcel we need to deliver it. If I was to bring it upstairs, can I maybe do something over here? What the heck? Why is this door a, not a door? Like, literally, fit, apparently air there reacts differently. All right. Now, if I climb through, there's a space where the elevator would have been. Okay. We're good. We're good. Like, the floor is completely open here now. So, do we risk jumping down or something like that? Because I feel like it's going to end. That's going to... Well, it's going to end badly, should I say. Curiosity has the better of me because I can't figure out what else to do. So, if I was to jump down... I'm gonna take the scream as that drop was probably, you know, further than what we anticipated and we're not getting back up. It does fit through! Okay, so that means we can take the parcel upstairs. Alright, now that's progression, right? I wasn't sure that would work. Now we go back upstairs, turn the other TV on. Can we bring the parcel through with us? We need to get on that floor. It's the second floor we need to get to somehow. That's really important. Alright, for now, turn the TV back on. So bring the parcel through with? Let's uh, see what happens. We, we can't! Actually, that's a good point. If I do that... Oh, I can't see where the elevator is, though. I don't know when's a good time to jump. Um, and again, loud. Here we go, here we go. Jump on top. Do we want to do this? Okay, I mean, we can get up to here. Oh, I see. I see how we get on that second floor. All right, guys, so we pull the lever. Now, quickly. That's it, that's it, that's it. Fuse, baby, fuse. Woo! All right, let's be quick now. Come on, kid. Recover, recover. Look at him. He's used to the static. Now, get ready to jump out. Here we go. Yes. Woo! Let's go! Let's go! We're out. I thought we just died. I was about to be suspect as freak right there. So we got out. Um, hey, Toy. How the freak you doing? Okay, well, we made it. Um, don't think we can quite scale back there. That's interesting, though. All right, let's keep moving forward. What is this second floor, then? What's the difference here? There's another toy, and there's a walkway. Aha! What secrets are you housing? Box of, uh, you know, secret hiding. Oh, the doll's coming with us, apparently. Ooh, yeah, this floor don't feel safe, does it, Dolly? Oh, no, she's already fallen victim. Into the bathtub. Okay, okay, we just about made that. Let's go for the jump. Make it, make it. Oh, our tippy toes literally touched that. So here we go, guys. She's very fixated. She's tapping the monitor. She's, like, calling for whatever's in there to try and come out and greet her almost. If we turn that off, what happens? What happens? Oh, she knows we're here. She knows, she knows, she knows. Do we draw back? Put the monitor on. Put it on, put it on. Put it on, put it on. Oh, that was a difficult one. I don't really know what we do here. Hey, lady. Channel's over. Time for bed. Okay, now try and make the jump. Grab the toilet seat. Oh! Oh! 
whoa, 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 whoa. She even tried to do that while she was still being taken out. All right, you statically charged fiend. Let's go. Oh, that's not like an insult. Was that good? Yeah, now we drag this stall over. The TV's completely blown out in this room. Whoever the lady was, this was the last place she was before she transformed and could never pull back from whatever was bringing her in so much on that TV channel. Just noise to us. But there's something more going on in this world, guys. There was way much more. Look at this. You have gangs down alleyways. This is your modern day gang. And this is what the dealer is giving. Look at that. Just a chance to look at the TV some more. Yeah, guys, that channel sucks. I've seen that. It's a rerun. I'm spoiling it for you. I'm not, be I'm not being around there, guys. I'm not wasting my time here. So... Oh, it's like a toy store or something. What is this? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. This store expands out a lot. Dang, look at all this. We got water down there. This whole place is electrified. That TV is turned on, meaning we got to find some other spot. Maybe we can generate some power. But now, let me just see if I can explore. We can't get up that side. Uh, that's not good. Okay, so there's also a switch just up there. How would we even try and get up there? Can we climb up this side and just, like, walk along the thing? Look, we can't even do that. No, it won't let us grab that. Can we climb these? We can't even climb those. He's so adamant on turning the TV off. That's all he wants to do. Wait, if we turn that off, does the electricity stop flowing through? Hang on, let me just try this. Okay. The electricity is still fizzling, though, everywhere. So that doesn't stop the problem that we have. Can we, like, jump perfectly here and land on that? That's so sketch! That's so sketch! I do not like this. Yeah, there's just about enough space for this. I was thinking we use this as a platform. I mean, by all means, we might be able to use it here. Let's just give this a try. Like, can we climb up and touch the sign, maybe? Yeah, we just do a pull-up. Yeah, we get it. Your lower body strength is pretty good, or your upper body. Now, let's get rid of this, okay? Geronimo! Woo! Oh, that thing nearly fell over. Oh, that landed pretty close to where I wanted it to. Oh, and it's just getting better. That could not have been any more perfect, could it, huh, Mono? It's like a plan falling perfectly together. Okay, let's go. Now, can we get to that, the switch up there? I kind of feel like we can't. Let's just walk our way down. Now, there's no way we can get up, but we need to. There is a small way we can jump on through, and it happens in the child's bedroom slash a workshop of some kind. Hard to tell which one this is. It might have been a little bit of both, guys, to be honest. This will be the workstation here. Several toys on there already. Looking like some are unfinished, some are completely done. But that's all we got to do here. Now, if we go ahead and eat this switch, though, what about the people outside? Hold up. Ah, I thought something more was going to happen. Wait, but there's no electric flowing through anymore, which means that we can move freely, correct? If we move over here, I can travel this place now. All right, I don't get hurt, but what can I really do here? Is this what we needed to do? Okay, let's try this. If we move the shopping cart back about here... Maybe we can make the jump across and that's all we need. Do we need the power of the TV on, though, to get back here at some point? I don't really know. Like, why can't we just jump across now and that's it? Let's try that, actually. So, yeet. Let's go. And we'll make the jump again. I mean, we can test it. It works. Oh, wait. I bet the TV links to a power source above us, right? Well, fortunately, the power can stay off us. We're still kind of walking around here in the water. Lift ourselves on up. And then we get back on dry land, get the power back on, and then I think we know what we do after that point there. Yeah, you're coming back down. There's that power. Now make the jump that way. Oh! We turned into a sparkler. Attempt number two, aka the version where we don't become a sparkler. So let's make the jump first of all there. Nice, nice. And one more jump there. Nice, nice again. Yes! Pull me in! Oh, it does! Yes, I was hoping it puts above. Now that window right there is wide open. And I don't have a torch, so I can't see anything. All right, let's go, let's go. It's the only way we can move. What? Oh my gosh. They're like waiting back there. Okay, keep some clearance, keep some clearance. Goodness, look at them all. What the freak? They're clawing at that TV over there. If we turn that TV on, bad things might happen. Therefore, let's experiment. Uh, hello? Why didn't bad things happen? We need to draw these guys away. Ah, uh, I think I got what we to Bring it back, bring it back, bring it back! Okay, go hide, hide, hide. Because they'll see the TV, right? Oh yeah, we are trash! We are literally a piece of paper that was thrown on the floor. Oh, you believed it, you suckers. How are these guys down here though? Like, what are they doing? They're just standing there. Not doing much of anything. Oh, 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 okay! I spoke too soon! Oh! Yeah, you see us, suckers! Yeah, tr oh, they're gonna try and get us. Oh my god, oh my god. Okay, move, move. They're gonna break the windows. They want us dead. Oh, they're coming. 
Why do you want it so much? Go, go, go. Oh, there's a chase sequence. Keep them TVs on. Keep them TVs on. Yeah, that's it. You get distracted, suckers. Let's move. How long will it keep them distracted? Oh, is it low enough? No, 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 no. They're staying fixated on us. Look at them moving. Go to the TV. Go, go. Now that's a one-way trip I like. Wow, this is a bizarre chapter, guys. This is a crazy chapter. All right, guys, I think I'm going to call this episode here. Now, I've been playing this for like an hour 25 because I've spent so much time looking for as many secrets as I can and things like that. This was a lot more difficult, though. The puzzles have ramped up, and the storyline for this one is very, very interesting. It's showing civilization maybe that did not manage to get on the moor. Either way, this entire world went catastrophically bad, and we are just simply bearing whatever's happening here. It ain't good, guys, but we got to keep mustering on through because we need to find six and also, whoever the freak that top hat dude was, we don't know who he is. I think he might own the broadcast center and be the main key behind all of everything that's happening, but who knows, guys? That's just me speculating. I do feel like we're drawing into the end, and guys, if you do want that next episode real soon, I think you know exactly what to do. But for this one right here, this is where we're going to leave it, okay? This was Little Nightmares 2, and I really hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, why not drop me that like crane? And hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here? So thank you so much for watching this video, guys. Of course, I hope you did enjoy, and we will get six back next episode. Watch it happen.